People are getting out of work early. Some of the metros are closed down, like National Airport and Union Station, and uh, the schools are getting out two hours early. Okay, what's Kenya Avenue. What's up, buddy? How we doing? Yeah. And it's there, and you can reread it. Think about it. Buildings have been evacuated, and um, Congress and, has, and the State Department and all the tourist attractions. The White House has been evacuated. This is Capitol Hill. Beanie is here. I can't go any further. It's Pennsylvania. <laughs> Tell you what, there's a metro transit officer right down there. Ask him what metro station is around the area. You would take, you would take the orange to uh, uh, to metro station. The blue lines are running slow. Stop you on the off the gallery. through, ma'am. It's the only street going through. Parking lot. Yeah? What? What? Are you Chris? Um, I work with IMC. You work with who? IMC? Who's that? Freelance, independent media. I'm just drive, riding my bike across town. You got town. Any, any identification or anything? Um, might have a card or something. Huh? Why? What, what's the problem? I mean, you just pull up here and start taking pictures. I'm just curious why you're taking pictures. Because, I mean, the whole town is very newsworthy right now. I'm just taking pictures. I'm just riding my bike across where's town. And where's your press credentials? I know that. I know what you're saying, but just show me some press credentials or something. I don't have any on me. I don't, you know. Let me see your bills. I mean, you got Bush cheated on here and yeah. all this, all this stuff here. So? Huh? So it's freedom. It's a freedom of expression. Usually. I know that, but on a day like today, we gonna be a little bit more cautious of who we dealing with. Okay? Mm -hmm. So you, you can't fault me doing my job, right? You understand know what I'm saying? Uh, well, I, I'm not I'm telling just, you nothing. I'm just wanting to know who you are. That's all. I was just taking a picture of that um, car that's blocking and I, and the I'm parking spot. And I'm, cur and I'm here curious. I'm curious to know I'm why you're taking pictures of everything okay. along right, this way. Alright, go ahead. I mean, you know, I, I, I'm, I'm just checking. Just check to see you okay. All right. Yeah. For my sake. Right. Okay. This is 
the view from D in South Capitol. Without permission. From whom? 122, you back clear with fuel 122. House and Senate Gal Press Gallery. Because that's the rule, that's the law. Okay. No, it's not. Yeah, it is. Well, prove it. Prove Show it? me, yeah. Okay. Oh, oh, man. Man. I have uh, things to mess with you. I have better things to do than mess with you. Isn't the sidewalk all right? No. Why? Come with me. I need you to come back. Turn the camera off, please. Okay. Camera I'm off. sorry, I don't have to do that. Okay, then What's I need wrong? your identification then. Why? What's wrong? What did because I do? This is a police secured area and you broke through it. Okay, technically you can be arrested for lawful entry. I went down the sidewalk. He told you that this was closed. I'm listening to the radio. I can't okay. listen. I can't hear everything that's going on. Tell him to uh, call for somebody for me. In addition to being filmed. Yeah. We need somebody down here. Is this enough to arrest your I just went down the sidewalk. I you know, well, I'm riding to get my a bike. Supervisor down here first, and then I needed to get to that officer too because if he told her that she wasn't supposed to come down, I'm sorry, I, I did not, I did not break any law. I'm sorry, but okay. I, I'm, I'm a federal I'm just officer, making, and I'm, I'm going to explain something to you. Listen to me. Bike listen ride to me. Town. Please That's listen. All. Listen to this, ma'am. I am a federal police officer. Yeah. I just asked you for identification. You failed to give it to me under the federal law that is an arrestable offense. Now I'm going to ask you one more time, please. Why did you stop me going down the sidewalk? May I your license you know you for identification? Hold on. You know what you need to do? Okay, it's just go to the other side. You're in the inside of the room, all right? That's, now, I don't, now, that's, that's fine, I'll do that. Okay, there's no more argument, okay? Yeah. I'm telling you right now, take your bike, your camera, and go to the other side. Okay, I fine. I don't care if you, if you film over there, but you're inside the inner room. Do you understand that? All I was doing was okay. riding my bike down the street. I didn't mean to break any laws. No problem. Enough said. You just need to go over there. This is crazy, man. Can't even ride your bike down the street. Dangerous word right now, federal building. There's the mall over there. People dead at the Pentagon. There's like 2,000 people dead. This is L'Enfant Plaza. Most places are kind of deserted downtown. Have been shut down. And the State Department were evacuated. Bush is in Louisiana right now.
everyone was immediately evacuated out of the Pentagon as soon as it happened. They saw a plane smash into the side of the Pentagon. You can't get through on sell your phones in New York because they are building with all the communications equipment was destroyed. It just started getting really smoky in the past. Yeah, you're getting more smoky. All you gotta do is go across the bridge over there, and you can go, you can go right up to it. Uh huh. These guys are looking for the act. Whatever. What happened? Uh, are, is it okay? I haven't heard about the state department. Nothing, because in the news they were talking about like a car bomb, but then they said it was just a rumor and then... I don't know, I don't see anything coming from that way, so I don't know. Mm -hmm. I, all, I've known, all I've heard about is the Pentagon and the New York incident. Oh, I'm sorry, what? All I've heard about is the Pentagon and the New York incident. I don't know about the uh, state bomb. Okay, it's okay then? They just evacuated it. I don't know. <laughs> hey. Yeah, you can get it. What are you drawing? The code red has been put in, into effect in the nation's capital. Oh. President Bush was in a in Florida for an appearance about literacy for children. The U.S. is in a national state of emergency. A third plane was hijacked and crashed into the side and uh, an unknown number of people are still trapped inside. Airlines are shut down. Terry. Across the bridge to Arlington. A stunning failure of intelligence.
Every five feet. Yeah, for now. Yes, sir. Right here, straight across. Everyone to the left of the guardrail. Left of the guardrail. That includes you, please, ma'am. Thank you. What's that? club. I made it personnel. White House, the State Department, and CIA have been evacuated. Operating theory is that the plane was headed toward the towards the White House.
four hijacking simultaneously. Obviously, someone in the cockpit knew how to get to the plane to the target. They're telling us to <coughs> they're telling us all to stay home and not take any unnecessary trips. Constitution shut down, the entire thing. They're trying to call, check to see what's going on. about as close as you can get to the White House right now.
He is participating in the National Security Council meeting by telephone. Vice President Dick Cheney has been in the White House underground in the White House Operations Center. The situation is with some four or five command and control structures throughout the day. Other national security officials receiving information from around the country and directing U.S. operations from there. We do know on Air Force One and moved from Louisiana to the Midwest. The President spoke to the mayor of New York and the governor of New York. He's been in constant contact with officials back here, including members of the congressional leadership, who also have been asked by their security to go to a secure bunker area built for just such a situation. A national security emergency in the United States. The leaders of Congress taken as well to a secure location. Again, the White House grounds were evacuated when all this was taking place this morning. For this first up here, which you are familiar with from anybody inside politics, you can still see smoke walking up from the Pentagon. San National Airport across the Potomac River. All of those things come to mind. But I want to ask you about that because there has to be many people out there watching who feel betrayed, who feel, who want to know why is it that something, how is it that something on this scale could be carried off and they thought the United States was the safest country on the planet? Yeah, that's a good